Now, as you have complete information of all the cards, you can easily decide the different combination of cards to get the required configuration. For example, if you want to connect two analog trunk lines, two mobile lines, one ISD and BRI line, two digital key phones, four standard analog phones, and one voicemail into Eternity PE system. To meet this requirement, we need Eternity PE 6SP platform and all these four cards. Before starting the installation or when you are unpacking the card and checking the package contents, make sure that you are wearing the anti-static belt. Now, let us see how all these four cards are meeting a requirement. This is TWT2 DKP2 SLT4 card. This meets the requirement of two analog trunk lines, two digital key phones, and four standard analog phones. This is GSM2 card. This meets the requirement of two mobile lines. This is BRI2 card. This meets the requirement of one ISDN BRI line. And finally, this is VMS16 card. And this meets the requirement of one voicemail system. Grasp the mentioned card by its sides or corners. Fit the card into connectors of any of the slot. Ensure that the card is seated perfectly. All the connector pins on the card must make complete contact with those on the CPU. Similarly, place the other three cards. When the card is firmly seated in the connector, use the three screws provided to secure it on the studs at the holes labeled as H1, H2 and H3. In addition to your requirement, you will have two extra free slots in the Eternity PE 6SP system which you may use for your future upgradation. For cards with multiple RJ45 connectors, the cables are bunched together but each cable is identified by a distinct color mark at the boot edge and the insulation edge of the cable. The color markings make it easy for you to identify the connector on the card into which the cable is plugged into and the hardware ports on that connector. Connect the cables to the respective RJ45 connectors one by one. Lead the cables out of the enclosure through any of the given outlets. Lead the cables neatly and tangle free with the help of the cable tie provided. This enables the cables to stay in position firmly. Now replace the top cover by sliding it in place. Secure the cover with the two screws you removed. The system is now ready for mounting. You can mount the Eternity PE either on a wall or in a rack.